I guess that's it then. I'm all alone. Not quite, Miss Khan. Jarvis? I assume you can keep this thing in the air? For quite some time, yes. Oh, that's a relief. There's no hope. But I can't just give up. This can't be how it ends. I can't believe I'm all alone in here. This is Bill Shelton, live on the scene here in Manhattan. What we witnessed tonight is something this nation has lived in terror of for five years. A tragedy on the scale of A-Day was narrowly avoided over the skies of New York, thanks to the quick actions of advanced idea mechanics. If not for the fast response of their defense forces, the Chimera would surely have crashed into Manhattan, doing untold damage to this densely populated city. The Avengers are indeed back, but their motivations are unclear, and their tactics as concerning as ever. Much of America rests uneasy tonight as they wonder where these once mighty heroes could appear next, what their goals are, and what kind of destruction they might leave in their wake. Wow. Even the S.H.I.E.L.D. guys left. Maybe they thought Hulk was gonna smash the place up. Jarvis, is there a recording of Bruce's interrogation of Monica? Certainly, miss. You can access it in the interrogation antechamber. If I may be so bold, Miss Khan, what do you hope to find in the interrogation footage? I don't know. I have to try something. Maybe she slipped up. Aim's the real enemy. I wish Bruce and Tony could see that. No offense, Jarvis, but I sure wish there was another person on board. None taken, Miss Khan. <sighs> okay. Interrogation footage. There's got to be a clue here somewhere. Let me guess. You're planning a big reveal at the Adaptoid launch. Come on, Monica, give me something. <laughs> Scour the Earth. You will not find our lab. The Adaptoids will launch, Bruce. Saving the world requires sacrifice! Ugh, this is useless. I just want to talk to my dad. Calling Yusuf Khan. N no, no, don't, Jarvis, I didn't mean to... Hello? Rita, is that you? Oh. Well, come on, if you're there, I miss you so much. Look, I'm not angry. I just want you to come home. I'm sorry. I should never have told you to hide your powers. Perhaps you're scared. A little unsure, but I... The important thing is that you always stay true to yourself. I love you, Beta. I love you more. will launch <laughs> scour the earth you will not find our lab scour the earth you will not find our lab scour the earth 
You will not scour the earth. Scour the earth? That's it. Of course, the satellite. The satellite. Avengers, if you can hear me, I think I found a clue. Look, I know I messed up. I wanted to blame AIM so bad for what happened to me on A-Day, it blinded me. But Cap must have had a good reason for what he did. I, I know it. People, people believe in the Avengers. Not just because of your cool powers, but, but because no matter how bad things get, no matter how much you disagree, you always come together. Don't you get it? Your differences are your greatest superpower. I was just some weird kid from Jersey who didn't fit in. But you saw me for who I really was. You accepted me. There's still a bad guy out there who wants to hurt the world. But we can stop him. Good isn't a thing you are. It's a thing you do. shouldn't have said. I get it. <sighs> Altitude, dry eyes. Look, I'm uh, not very good at... I'm sorry, so... Same. Good enough. Yep. So, you, uh... Found a clue? Yeah, it's the interview. Listen. Scour the earth. You will not find our lab. Okay. Monica's right. The lab's not on Earth. I'm not following. Okay, when I was captured, Monica and Tarleton had this argument. Tarleton had to leave the room, and then Monica pulled up the coordinates to this satellite called Ambrosia. Ambrosia? That was a S.H.I.E.L.D. biomedical research project. AIM must have required it during the takeover. It would be a great place to hide proof of inhuman experiments, right? If you wanted to study inhumans on the cellular level, then zero gravity would be a perfect place to do it. Good job. Okay, so we know where we need to go. We just need a way to get there. Project Star Booster. As I recall, you abandoned it because you couldn't generate enough acceleration in the auxiliary rockets. Yeah, yeah, no need to bore everyone with the details. That was before I had access to Mr. Shrinky. Jarvis, get Pim on the phone. We need a way to get up to this space lab. He's the only one who can help. Thank you. 